This video provides you with a brief overview of the Blackboard Grade Center. To get into the Grade Center of your course, select Grade Center, followed by the full Grade Center on the control panel. Once in the Grade Center, you'll notice the full Grade Center resembles an Excel spreadsheet. Each row corresponds to a student within your course. You'll notice the first three columns, last name, first name, and last access are grayed out. This is because they are frozen in the Grade Center. Depending upon the number of rows and columns you have in your Grade Center, you may see horizontal and vertical scroll bars. Notice the frozen columns stay in place as you scroll horizontally. Near the top of the screen, you will see a series of buttons. These buttons include Create Column, Create Calculated Column, Manage, Reports, Filter, and Work Offline. Create Column allows you to add columns to the Grade Center. They're not tied to any particular assignments you've created. One example of this would be to include a participation column within the Grade Center. Create Calculated Column allows you to add columns that are going to be tied to particular items within the Grade Center, whether assignments, discussions, or tests. This also has a feature of a weighted column, which allows you to set up weighted percentages for the course. Manage allows you to operate things such as grading schemas, grading color, codes, or categories. The Reports feature allows you to create reports based on certain grading history. With the Work Offline button, you can download information from your Grade Center directly into Excel in order to work away from Blackboard. You can then later upload it back into Blackboard. The Filter option allows you to filter particular information from the Grade Center where you don't have to see it all at once.